Patrick Roberts away down the right hand side, plays it into the box, looking for Chris Rigg. It's broken kindly towards Isidore who shoots, takes oh, a deflection, it's what a save. in front of Alex Palmer. What a save that is. And the ball may have even hit him in the face there. Thankfully, he's able to get out to it quickly and smother it. The deflection almost taking it past Palmer, but thankfully, the baggies number one makes a really smart save. Well, it's an excellent bit of play from Sunderland, to be fair. And it takes a horrible deflection. But Alex Palmer stands up very, very well. And I think you're right, I think it hits him in the face. To take it off the toes of Carlan Grant, it runs all the way through to Mason Holgate. Holgate fires it out to the right-hand side. Here is Fellows, three around him. Fellows, cross comes oh, in, there it it's is. Josh Madger. Oh, oh, and he slips over at the vital early. moment. In between the six-yard box and the penalty spot, just to the right of it. Leaning a little bit backwards there. Didn't make clean connection. He cuts the ball back to Madger, and I think he's just slightly behind him, which is why Madger slips, but what a great opportunity, and it's our first real chance. Stepping inside onto his left foot, 30 yards away from goal. He's gone past three here. Patrick Roberts shoots, takes the deflection. Get out to him. Ricochets to a Sunderland man. Here's 09, a cross oh, goal, an and goal. into the back of the net, and it might be an own goal for the second game in a row, but the referee has disallowed it. There's an offside flag up on the far side at Albion have had a huge let-off at the Stadium of Light as we approach the hour mark. Sunderland's joy is cut short, it remains goalless. Well, I'd like to be able to tell you whether he was offside or not or what happened there, but it's the other end of the pitch. Straight away, Ratchet's got his hand up. You know, can only assume he was offside there. On the left-hand side, Elise back to Mayenda, into the penalty area he goes. Mason Holgate gets there first, wants to try and shield this one out, but it's been kept in play and it's pulled backwards great chance for Sunderland and it's a great block what a two block. Albion players throwing what themselves at the ball there is. and they somehow keep it out the net Mason Holgate taking a big risk tried yeah. to shield the ball out of play didn't have enough pace on it was kept in play by Mayenda it was pulled backwards and the strike at goal is brilliantly blocked away well we, we can't see from here but that never from here it looked like he had enough pace to go out of play his mates have dug him right out of it there because they've thrown their bodies on the line and got a great block Lightning Dobbin as well, he's got pace to burn, hasn't he? You know, they're your players you rely on to get back in and help your other players out, and he does exactly that and slows it down. Here's Mepham, Isidore, that's a nice touch from him. Rig out to the right-hand side. Here comes Sunderland, Trey Hume pulls it backwards. Great chance, it's hit towards goal, and it's just evaded the far post. Looked like it might creep in. Our name's on the cup. I'm telling and you. it's gone just wide. I think it was Chris Rig there. Wow. The man who almost made it 1-0 to Sunderland, but thankfully for Albion, it goes wide of Alex Palmer's far post instead of creeping inside it. It remains goalless with just over 15 minutes to play. Well, we're certainly riding our luck at the moment, but you know what? We deserve a little bit of luck, Jez. We haven't had a lot. And that is so, so close. Be a chance for the baggies to break. Sunderland get bodies back in position quickly. Grant is dispossessed. Isidore tries to get there. Hegem hits it forward and he's found. Tell you Lewis what he's Dobbin hit. Dobbin, swift. Right-hand side, 30 yards away from goal, pushes it forward to Tom Fellows. Fellows That's pulls it backwards, and, and here's a great chance for Alvin oh, in front of the line. It, it was Lewis with, Dobbin. Has it come off Alex Boas? And it was Dan Ballard with a back flick, virtually on the goal line, to stop it creeping into that bottom corner. The baggies, whiskers away, well, whiskers away from scoring the game's first goal of the night.